Hello everyone. In the previous lecture, we had studied about paradigm system approaches and models in geography. So today we are going to start a new chapter or a new topic of uh, MAMC geography, second year students. And its name is recent trends in geography. recent trends in geography and our first subtopic is field survey process studies and exp experimental studies so let's begin to our topic first let's see the what is a field survey or a field research Field research is a defined as a qualitative method of a data collection that aims to observe, interact and understood people while they are in a natural environment. For example, nature observe behavior of animal in their natural surrounding and the way they react to certain scenarios. In the same way, social scientists conducting the field research may conduct interview or observe people from a distance to understand how they behave in a social environment and how they react to situation around them. Learn one more thing, qualitative observations in uh, field research or a field uh, survey. Field research a diverse range of social research method including the direct ob direct observation limited participation analysis of documents and other information so informal interview uh, survey etc although the field study is a generally characterized as a qualitative uh, research is often involved in multiple aspect of quantitative research Field survey a typical begins in a specific setting although the end objective of the study is to observe and analyze the specific behavior of a subject, the cause and effect of certain behavior through is tough and analyzed due to a presence of multiple variables in a natural environment. Most of the data collection is based not entirely on the cause and effect but mostly on correlation. While the field uh, survey look for a correlation, the small sample size make it make it difficult to establish establish a casual relationship between two or more variables. Next is methods of field research or a field survey. First is direct observation. In this method, the data is collected via observational method or a subject in a natural environment. In this method, the behavior or outcome of situation is not interfered in any way by the researcher. The advantages of direct observation is that it offers data on people, situation, interaction and the surrounding. So this method of uh, field research or field uh, study widely used in a public setting or environment but not in a private environment as there is an ethical dilemma. Next is participant observation. In this method of field research, the research is deeply involved in the research process not just purely as an observer but also as a participant. This method too is conducted in a natural environment but the only difference is the researcher gets involved in the discussion and can the direction of the discussion. In this method research live in a comfortable environment with the participant of the research to make the comfortable and open up to in a depth discussion. Then the next is ethnography. Ethnography is an expanded observation of social research and the social perspective and the cultural value of an entire social setting. In the ethnography, entire communities are observed objectively or observed objectively. Then next is the qualitative interviews. 
qualitative interview are closed ended question that are asked directly to the research our our subject or a research subject the qualitative interviews could be either informal and converse conversational semi structure standardized and open ended or a mix of all the above three this provide the wealth of the data to research that they can sort through this also help to collect relational data this method of field study or field survey can use a mix one or one one on one interviews focus group and uh, group and text analysis our last is case study a case study research is an in a depth analysis of a person situation or event this method may look difficult to operate however it is one of the simplest way of conducting research as it involves a deep and through the understanding of the data collection method and inferring data then our third most important part is tips in conducting field survey or a field research so first important is build the right team or a make a right team for your study second is recruiting people for the study data it is a necessary part study data collection third one is you have to need a which methodology we will use in your studies then site visit sorry for this mistake site visit site visit and fifth one is data analysis analyze analysis the of the data that is collected is important to validate to validate of the field uh, research and decide to outcome of the field research and then the communicating uh, result once you have to analyze the data and it is important to communicate the result to stakeholders of the research so that it could be action so let's see the definition of a survey survey and experiment first is a definition of survey here is given notes for your exam so experiment and survey method are highly important in a data gathering both can be utilized to test hypothesis and come up with conclusion so our uh, research through experiment involve the manipulation of an independent variables as a measuring its effect and effect on a dependent variable so on the other hand conducting survey of uh, of the entails the use of questionnaires and a uh, interview questionnaires and interview so let's see the details in a survey so from the medieval latin word super vider which means to see survey is defined as having a comprehensive view of a certain topic survey studies are largely conducted to looks into people's opinions feeling and thoughts so it is the base uh, suited for a descriptive research with the seek to answer seek answer, answer and what question regarding the respondent so questionnaire is or ideal in a collecting information from a big population as they can be simultaneously admitted to different group and individual survey question can be sent to numerous respondent in both online and offline for instant research who are studying happiness level among the millennials plotted questionnaire is made the phone calls and send emails regarding the participant perceived emotional state and the data were then the collected 
and uh, statistical treatment such as the getting the weighted means was utilized to analyze uh, the response. So, next is experiment from the Latin word experiment from the Latin word experior which means to attempt or uh, to experience experiment it defined as a testing a hypothesis by carrying out a procedure under highly controlled conditions. So, this may come made ideal in a studying primary data. So, by manipulating a certain independent variables. So, it effect on the development variable can be major and then the cause and effect relationship is verified by exposing participant to a certain treatment for the instant researchers can measure how water intake can affect people's metabolism by letting the experimental groups drink 8 glasses of water each day while the control groups will only have 4 glasses. So, their metabolism rates will then be compared of after a week and a statistical treatment like t-test. So, you will study in the sem second semester in a statistical geography. So, t-test uh, t will be employed to validate results. So, I hope you understood about the experiment, survey and uh, field research. So, here is given a dis uh, difference between survey and exper experiment. Given the survey uh, concept and experiment. Survey refers to a technique of gathering information regarding a variable under study from the respondent of the population and then the experiment implies as a scientific procedure where the factor under study is isolated to test hypothesis using descriptive research and experiment research. Sample large, relatively small, social and behavioral science, physical and natural science, field research, laboratory research, observation, interview questionnaires, case study, etc. and in experimental studies through the several regarding of experiments. So, note down this in your notebook. This also given for you. You can also write for a deep knowledge about the survey and experiment. So, pause this video and write down this 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 6 points. So, let us see the advantage of field research. It is conducted in a real world and a natural environment where there is no tampering of variable and the environment is not detected. Second is due to the study being conducted in a compatible environment, data can be collected even about the ancillary topics. And last one is the researcher gains a deep understanding into the research subject due to the proximity to them and hence the research in extensive through and accurate. So, it is an advantage. Let us see the disadvantage of field research or field survey. First one is the study are expensive and uh, time consuming and and can take a year to complete. Second is it is a very difficult for researcher to distance themselves from the bias in the research study. Third one is the notes have to be exactly what the research say but the nomenclature is very tough to follow. Fourth one is it is an interpretive inter to method and this is subjective and entirely dependent on the ability to ability of researcher. Last one is in this method it is a uh, impossible to control external variables and this constantly alters the nature of the research. So, I hope you understood about about uh, experiment survey and uh, field studies. So, in the next lecture we will uh, learn about the computer based cartography, remote sensing, GIS and geoinformatics.
सो हिर इज अ सब टॉपिक ऑफ रिसेंट ट्रेडिंग जोग्राफी सो थैंक यू स्टूडेंट्स